triangle, solve for the missing angle. So this is a digital lesson, and it starts out telling students how we define different triangles. So there's two different methods. We can define them by the measurement of their angles or by the length of their sides. So if we define them by the measurement of their angles, we have the definition of an acute, a right, and an obtuse triangle. If we designate them by the length of their sides, then we have isosceles, equilateral, and scalene. Now on slide five, they're gonna use the draw line tool to connect a type of triangle to its visual. So they come up here to the draw line tool, select a line, and they're gonna get a little plus sign. So they just click where they wanted to start. And when they click on this little blue circle at the end, click and hold, then they can move that line where they want. So students can play around with this. They may want a different color for their line. They can also change the thickness of their line. So they're going to connect each of these to the correct picture. Now it explains that if the three angles of a triangle will always add up to 180 degrees. So how do we find a missing angle? Well, we use algebra. So it shows them how to do this. You add the three angles, 45 plus 70 plus X. We know it's going to equal 180 degrees. Combine like terms, subtract, and then we have the missing angle measurement. So students are going to be doing this on their own. Here's another example. When they get to slide eight, then they have to fill in the missing parts of the equation. So it starts out giving them the equation. Here they just have to combine like terms, and then they have to subtract. Okay, and then that will give them the missing angle. The next one, they have to do a little bit more work. The equation is not given to them. Also, they have to know that this is a 90 degree angle. So 40 plus 90 plus X, solve for X. Same thing on the next one, just a different type of triangle. And then they're going to come to a triangle where they have variables on two of the angles. So here they have to add X plus X plus 2 plus 90 equals 180. So this one's it's mostly done for them. All they have to do is give the answer here when they subtract and then divide by 2. And then they have to give the three angles of the triangle, what they all three measure. The next one, they're going to do more of it themselves. So here they just have to fill in the 56 and combine like terms and then subtract and divide. And then again, they have to type in all three angles. When they get to the last slide, they're going to be given the angles of a triangle. So 80, 65 and X and they have to figure out the missing angle. The last one's a little bit more difficult. It has a 5x. So when they figure out what x is, then they'd have to multiply by 5. So that is a digital lesson on triangles, finding the missing angle.